now we are going to discuss some problems in refraction of light at plane surfaces right the given statement is the refractive index of glass is 3 by 2 find the speed of light in glass here the refractive index of glass n is given that is 3 by 2 we know the speed of light in vacuum or speed of light in air is you know that is 3 into 10 power 8 meters per second now we can find the speed of light in glass so that is v you know the formula n equal to c by v from n equal to c by v you know v equal to c by n c is 3 into 10 power 8 meters per second by so n value 3 by 2 now 3 into 10 power 8 so now it is written as reciprocal 2 by 3 now 3 3 get cancelled then 2 into 10 power 8 meters per second now the speed of light in glass is 2 into 10 power 8 meters per second next problem the speed of light in diamond is 1,24,000 kilometers per second find the refractive index of diamond if the speed of light in air is 3 lakhs kilometers per second right here speed of light in diamond is given that is v 1,24,000 kilometers per second the speed of light in air is 3 lakhs kilometers per second now we want to find the refractive index of diamond you know n so from you know the formula n equal to c by v here c is 3 lakhs kilometers per second 3 lakhs kilometers per second is nothing but 3 into 10 power 8 meters per second by 1,24,000 kilometers per second here kilometers per second kilometers per second cancel so three zeros three zeros get cancelled 300 by 124 so approximately it is 2.42 now the refractive index of diamond is 2.42 you know the refractive index has no unit next problem a ray of light enters from a to a medium x so the speed of light in the medium is 1.5 into 10 power 8 meter per second and the speed of light in air is 3 into 10 power 8 meter per second find the refractive index of the medium x right in medium x the speed is so the speed in in medium x is 1.5 into 10 power 8 meters per second the speed of light in medium x is 1.5 into 10 power 8 meters per second now the speed of light in air is given that is 3 into 10 power 8 meter per second now we can find the refractive index of the medium x n same n equal to c by v you know c 3 into 10 power 8 meters per second by 1.5 into 10 power 8 meters per second here meter per second meter per second get cancelled 10 power 8 10 power 8 get cancelled 3 by 1.5 so 1.5 2 so that is a 2 so the refractive index of the medium x is 2 next problem an object placed at a depth of half meter in water is viewed from air at what depth it appears to be so in this problem refractive index of water is given that is 4 by 3 so object is in water so this is water 
object is in water so you know water is denser medium now viewed from air so air is rarer medium so this is water that is denser medium when light ray travel from rarer medium to denser medium refracted ray towards the normal so because this object image appears above the surface of original object you know this is called as a real depth of the object the distance between interface to object this is real depth when it is viewed from rarer to denser so the image of the object appears above the surface now so this image is come closer to the interface you know this is called as apparent depth right here in this problem object depth is given that is half meter it means real depth is given so the real depth so real depth so that is d is half meter nothing but 50 centimeters next refractive index of water is given refractive index of water that is 4 by 3 now we want to find apparent depth so apparent depth is d dash so d dash we can find now so refractive index n equal to real depth d by apparent depth d dash so it is the formula n equal to d by d dash now we want to find d dash apparent depth is nothing but appeared depth so d dash equal to d by n so what is d d is a 50 centimeters by n value refractive index of water 4 by 3 then it is written as 50 into 3 by 4 so 50 into 3 150 by 4 so 2 2s to 75 so 75 by 2 that is 37.5 centimeters now apparent depth of the object is 37.5 so this is the apparent depth so that appears on the surface of original object so this is called apparent depth 37.5 centimeters so real depth is at 50 centimeters so apparent depth appeared depth is 37.5 centimeters next problem an object placed in air at a height of 30 centimeters above the water surface is absorbed from water so what is the height perceived by the observer see here now you know this is interface water denser medium so here it is air rarer medium now object is in this is object object is in rarer medium so actually this object at a height of 30 centimeters you know this is called real height so the distance between interface to object so this is real height so real height of the object is 30 centimeters object is in rarer medium person is in denser medium now we are viewed the object from denser to rarer you know the light ray traveled from denser medium to rarer medium refracted ray is away from normal so because now so this image of the object image of the object appears above the surface of original object you know this image is called as apparent image so that height is called apparent height right so in this problem so refractive index of water is given so that is 4 by 3 now real height of the object also given so real height h is given that is 30 centimeters refractive index of water is given 
that is 4 by 3 now we can find apparent height so apparent height h dash we want to find now now the refractive index n equal to so the formula is apparent height h dash by real height h so n equal to h dash by h now we can find h dash h dash equal to n into h n is how much 4 by 3 into height real height of the object 30 centimeters now 3 ones 3 tens 4 into 10 40 centimeters now the apparent height of the object is 40 centimeters actually so that object is at a height of 30 centimeters from the interface when it is viewed from water to air now the image appears at a height of 40 centimeters now apparent height is 40 centimeters okay next problem refractive index of glass relative to water is 9 by 8 so what is the refractive index of water relative to glass right here refractive index of glass relative to water is 9 by 8 now we can find refractive index of water relative to glass now therefore refractive index of water relative to glass is 1 by refractive index of glass relative to water so that is 1 by refractive index of glass relative to water is 9 by 8 now it is written as 8 by 9 therefore refractive index of water relative to glass is 8 by 9 so 8 by 9 is the reciprocal of 9 by 8 next problem refractive indices of media p q r and s are given so p is p refractive index 1.31 q refractive index 1.33 r 1.52 s 1.50 in which of the four media the speed of light is maximum and minimum you know refractive index n equal to c by v now the relation between n and v is inversely proportional it means if refractive index is more velocity of light in that medium is less if refractive index is least then speed of light in that medium is more here p refractive index 1.31 q 1.33 r 1.52 s 1.50 out of all these values p has less refractive index because of less refractive index now p in p the velocity of light is maximum so maximum in p out of p q r and s in medium r the refractive index is 1.52 it is highest in these four mediums so because of more refractive index speed of light is minimum in medium r the speed of light is minimum speed of light is maximum in p speed of light is minimum in r